they've reached common ground on the key solutions to the challenges facing South Africa. Now, it's quite important um, getting a, an agreement on that. I mean, it's, you know, just in normal practice, um, it is often very difficult because we all, as individuals, we have different opinions on how to deal um, with the challenges um, of a country and on also political parties. And in order to reach a common agreement on some of the key things really is groundbreaking. And I must also reiterate that the convention it was not the first time um, that you know the partners have been talking to each other. So I've been chairing, coming into um, the negotiations, you know, chairing and um, the negotiations prior to the conference. And obviously, um, this convention is meant to really um, iron out the loss of um, of the issues um, um, and between between the parties and to get that formal um, agreement and to build a trust uh, between many parties that have in the past obviously competed very vigorously against each other, often uh, very in a very hostile uh, way against each other and now have to agree um, to partner in a coalition ahead of the election. So it's, it's obviously it's not easy um, to do that. And the parties have agreed to come together um, to, in the following months still, to come up with a much more substantial engagement on said policy because, you know, in two days you cannot agree on each and every policy, but you can agree on the key policies. So if they've done that, and, and um, so they commit to work on a fully fledged policy platform um, in a month um, to come based on the pillars of the agreement. Um, that have reached today. Okay, so they've reached really the pillar um, policy agreements, and now they have to substantiate that uh, much more fully in a fully flat uh, manifesto in the coming months. And obviously, they also have to keep it, they can't be too close yet because there's ongoing negotiations to bring in more parties. Um, you, you know, to uh, to the coalition, so you know, also to give other parties the opportunity to make some input. But the core, the pillars, have been agreed on, and it's a really significant moment um, for a group of parties that fought each other in the past to actually agree on the fundamentals of a policy platform. Second thing, they've agreed on the principles of power sharing. And you know that's very important. If you think of all of, you know, many of the coalitions that failed at a local level, it really has been, power sharing has been really an Achilles heel for many of the coalitions at a local level. And one of the reasons why many of the coalitions have failed because they've been unable to agree on how to share power. 